right guys so I don't know what happened to my video footage footage of this hair color on my hair but I just came to my laptop to try to import it from my camera and when I transported it over it was like I saw it transport but it's not really there and so I know it recorded it because I went back to play it on my camera just to make sure it had but nevertheless it's gone now so I was just basically showing you how I achieved this color on my hair yes so um there is this product and I guess it's been out for a while but I just stumbled across it just um about a week or so ago and it is the well there's two of them actually it is the curl smith hair makeup and as i am hair color so what you're seeing on my hair is a combination of both of these um because I, the videos that i saw for just this one for the uh bold gold color was giving off more copper and then this one was giving off a more like I'm gonna say to me it was a kind of a 1b30 from what I was getting from the youtubers that I saw that used use no use this one this one was giving off a more copper which of course that's what it is it's copper and this was 1b30 uh, color that I was seeing and so what I was trying to achieve was more of a like a honey blonde type of color um, I've got two wigs similar to the color so here's one wig it's probably not picking up no it's not really all right so here is a better picture of the wig the color that I was actually trying to achieve that's the one that I'm actually holding in my hand right now all right and then this is the other one so again it's not picking up and it may be I don't think that made it any better all right so here's the actual color of the wig I'm holding right now but I was trying to go for a more honey blonde golden honey blonde color and I believe by mixing these two together that's really what I achieved. So basically, um, this is really easy to apply. I mean, it's just like it says hair makeup. It's just like how you put makeup on your face, except you're putting makeup on your hair. And then what's cool about this is this is a gel. It is a, let's see, what does it actually say? It is a temporary color styling gel. So basically, you just apply it as if you were applying um a hair product to your hair so that makes it even more easy there was no mixing to do none of that it just comes out of this tube um i would show it but yeah it's just you know the color is copper and it just comes out as if you were applying some type of cream gel to your hair and so i applied that and then of course this one here this is how much i used to do this here on my hair um it actually smells like like I use the leave-in conditioner from as I am and it smells like that um that does this say it's a gel mm. that print is too small I ain't trying to read it right now but this one definitely says it's a gel but this goes on just as good you just I just put my hands in it and just rubbed it on my uh, worked it through my hair as if I was actually applying gel um, and then I twisted it now I want to say also that the definition that both of these was given without even me having to twist it was popping so I mean it's like whatever they used here for this color gel they just need to put it towards a gel period that don't doesn't even have color because the gel on this was popping I mean the curls from this using this gel was popping and um, I twisted my hair because I put this on late last night and I didn't want to wait for it to dry because I needed to go to bed. So I just went ahead and twisted and wrapped it up. And so I had it probably in about 
five twists over here and maybe eight over here and all I did was wrap it um, in a scarf and then this morning when I got ready to go to get ready to get ready for church um, I just untwisted it and then I just kind of fluffed it with the uh, diff diffuser I did a little bit of trying to uh, stretch it but this product is also was supposed to elongate your curls where they wasn't like very much shrinking and it did do that now it doesn't it's still not as long as my hair is but it still was uh, my hair was still able to reach to, to, oh my gosh i can't talk right now my hair was still able to retain some length versus how it normally you know shrinks up you know very drastically but yeah i just wanted to come and let you guys see this anyone that's wanting to you know get a new color for your hair and of course you don't want to go through the process of you know what it takes to get this look because sometimes when well a lot of times when you color your hair a blondish honey whatever color it typically will ruin your curls so uh, this doesn't do any of that you know you can just get a quick color for the day or the week um, this actually will stay in until I decide to wash it out I'm presuming um, I guess as the days go, it may weaken in its color, lessen with the vibrancy. But uh, for the most part, until I wash it out, then I'll have this color. And so I'm going to see, I'm eager because I want to try the red one. And now I know this looks really, really red. And of course, it's, I haven't even opened it yet. Uh, you can see this is still on there. But it's like really, really red but it does not come out that way I'm going to show you another wig that I have that what this color produces okay let's see whoa all right so ooh, that is coming off really really red so now this is giving a more burgundy here but what's coming across the screen is like this bow pow I don't know why I said bow. <laughs> Uh, okay, I can't get it to stay on the little hair wig holder, but I've worn this wig. Matter of fact, it's my, um, the, what is it called? My thumbnail? Not the thumbnail. It's my profile pic that I'm wearing this wig. So, yes, it's red, but this, I think this is coming off just a little bit more red than it actually is. This is giving, this is more of a deeper burgundy than what's coming across the screen but that's what this color is supposed to produce from youtubers that I've seen using the red so I'm excited to try that one out as well but yeah again if you're wanting a color you know and you don't want to go through the process of going through what it takes to get your hair actually colored you could just use this temporary hair color again this is curl smith i got this in the color copper they have other colors they have a turquoise they have um a gold they have a ruby and um i think it's pink gold no rose gold rose gold and um it may have more than that and then this one has like purple gray a green so they have other colors but of course you know I was just trying to stick to something that I could actually wear out you know in public that didn't just draw attention to my head but yeah guys I just wanted to come on I really hate that I don't have that footage because it was just a quick video of me applying this as you can see as as I'm putting it on how it's immediately already starting to bring color i mean it's not even like you don't even have to sit under a dryer or anything to get it to set it just instantaneously bam you got color so i just thought it was so cool so i'm going to turn around and let you see the back again this is a twist out but the definition again that this produces man it's just pretty amazing and i would have liked to have done it in a wash and go but again i was doing it at night and i didn't have time to wait for it to dry or diffuse because it was late my husband was asleep and i didn't want to disturb, disturb him so yeah so if you got now this here i got purchased from ulta you can get it online you can actually get it from amazon but i purchased from ulta 
Uh, this one's a little pricey because this was $19.99 for only three fluid ounces. But I was able to apply it this and I still got quite a bit apply it all over my head although I was using it in conjunction with this but I still have quite a bit here but yeah this one for just three fluid ounce is a little pricey and then we've got this one here that I got from Sally's and um, it was like $7.99 so it wasn't as bad and then you get more as you can see um, how many ounces is that six ounces versus so you get double <clears throat> from this so yeah guys uh, this is the look with this color it looks really natural it actually looks like I actually went and got my hair color it doesn't scream you know that I have temporary or at least it doesn't to me scream that I have temporary hair color on my hair but yeah I just wanted you to see it um, I did have a video so I don't have it maybe I'll do one for when I apply the red, I'll do one for the red since how, um, yeah, I couldn't show you me actually doing the application process of this. But I'll do one, Lord willing, <laughs> with the red color so you guys can see just how easy and simple it is. And another thing I want to mention um, as far as the transferring of this product onto you. So when you put this on, yeah, you, it says to apply with gloves, both of these. But, um... I just put it like I just dipped it out the drawer, a uh, jar, and out the tube, and just started putting on my hair. But how quickly this is to rinse out is I just put some water soap on my hands, and bam, it was already gone. And as far as the transfer, I wore this shirt to church, and I don't think anything. Now my hair hasn't reached that part, but I don't even think it's on my neck. I don't think there's anything showing there on my neck. So not too much of a transfer going on. Um, I did see where other videos were saying that it does transfer. I mean, of course, you want to be cautious of it. But it's nothing that won't come out because this stuff comes out, you know, it's not even like you got a scrub. It just comes out really good because, I mean, it's just a temporary hair color. As a matter of fact, someone said if it, like, were to rain and you had this in your hair, it would probably just rinse it all, <laughs> all out your hair. Because, only, I mean, you can get this out of your hair by just washing your hair doing a shampoo so you know if you're getting tired of it you get or let's say you try one and you're like mm, i don't like this just go get in the shower and wash it right on out so yeah uh i was excited about it i'm just thinking yeah this is pretty cool whoever invented something like this this was pretty nifty because i know when i was going to my girl's birthday party i wanted uh this look but um i didn't really want to have to wear a wig although i wound up wearing one but it would have been nice if i had already known about this and i could have used it and i could have rocked my own hair but hey it's all good i know now so yeah guys thanks for watching and i will see you all in my next video peace out